Hello, my name is Dashi. I'm just a regular ass dude from Florida, United States of America, but I do sniff plastics. Every other day I'm either at Walmart or at Best Buy buying a new Blu-ray movie. I've been sniffing plastics for like a hot minute. I mean like when I was like five, I was sniffing the shit out of my Fisher Price toys. I love sniffing plastic, that's my fing problem. And yeah, I love to sniff because that's my fing problem. I mean, shoot, the way I see it, it was either sniffing plastics or crystal meth. You know, sometimes I feel like you can tell a story with the movies I sniff. Like, check this out, right? I know that sniffing is super bad for you, you know what I'm saying? But at the same time, I feel like my life is straight out of a scary movie, you know what I mean? And, and check this out, right? This is not the life that I wanted, you know what I mean? And it makes me so frustrated, sometimes I just want to scream. Remind me to sniff the shit out of some movies in about two hours. Okay, I'll remind you to remind me to sniff the shit out of some movies in about two hours. When would you like to be reminded? Bitch, I said in two hours. I don't know what you mean by, bitch, I said in two hours. You know, there are days where I'll use my grocery money to go buy movies. But hey, everything tastes good with a little salt on it. So yeah, I feel like it's time that I told my best friend about my addiction. So he's supposed to come through in a little bit and, you know, hopefully it plays out well. Because I'm really nervous about telling him about this. You know, I'm really embarrassed. <laughs> Alright, man. I really appreciate you coming through. You're my best friend. And I honestly been waiting a long time to tell you about this problem that I have is an addiction that I have that I've been dealing with for a while and I feel like now is the right time to tell you um so here it goes man um I sniff plastic I'm sorry you sniff plastic that's your addiction I got out of work early I, I seriously got out of work early for this, PTO. I'm out of PTO. You made me use my fing PTO for this shit? What are these cameras for? Huh? You getting paid for this? I didn't sign a fing release form. Y'all can't use my fing face unless you cut the check. Seriously, that's what. This made me waste my motherfing PTO for this shit? People sucking shit on the street right now for fing three P's. Bullshit. God damn it. So you know, I'm gonna go see this shrink or whatever, but only cause y'all paying for that shit. Because yo, them motherfuckers charge a lot. I mean, how you gonna charge that much just to talk to somebody? Bitch, I call Lil Ray Ray and them. I talk to that bitch all day. She don't charge me shit. Hi. Hi. Nice to meet you, Dr. Johnson. Okay, Dash. Nice to meet you. Thank you for coming. I appreciate it. Of course. It. And you, no, no problem. No problem at all. So uh, why have you called me here today, Dash? All right, basically, I have an addiction that I want to try to work on because it is costing me a lot of money. So it's, uh, okay. and basically what it is is that I like to sniff um, video game uh, uh, cartridges, that, like the boxes, and then uh, also the uh, Blu-ray movies. Okay, interesting. What triggered this addiction for you? Um, I want to say it was when my uncle died, um, and, and, but what really f***ed me up was that he came back as a zombie, and I never seen no shit like that before, so like that really like f***ed me up, and, and I had to take him out, you know what I'm saying, so you have to take the head out, like pause, and you know what I'm saying, so like doing some shit like that, I felt like going to sniffing, like really helped me cope with, with what was going on with my uncle and shit. Yeah, I understand. Yeah. I'm so sorry for your loss there. So I just want to clarify, you're sniffing game cartridges and Blu-ray movies. That's correct. Okay, are you actually watching the movies? I'm gonna keep it real with you, like I'm gonna keep it about 300 with you. Um, I don't actually own a Blu-ray player, Okay. so I'm not watching the movies that I'm sniffing. Okay, well I wasn't sure if you're aware, but Best Buy is actually having a sale right now. $169 for a Blu-ray player. So are you actually planning on buying one? I feel like you just disrespected me. 
Well, yeah, no. Okay, I'm saying like you, you're trying to say you just basically call me bro. No, like no. in front of everybody, this cameraman right here, this dude, you just call me bro. No, and, and no, I, no, and no, I don't no, appreciate no. you in my house. No, I, I, I didn't mean to imply. I wasn't implying that at all. I just look. Can we just move on to the next? Yes. Because this is. Yeah. I feel we, a can, we can. I'm sorry. We can. I'm just we saying. Move on. Like I'm like. Don't mean to Chris Brown. Brown. on your life. Okay. I just want to make sure that you understand how this could potentially be harming your body. How the hell is me sniffing a movie gonna harm my body? Can you please break this down to me, please? Well, for one, plastic particles can break off of the case, fly into your nose, which will go into your brain and cause stupid brain syndrome. This bitch just called me stupid. Y'all heard that? What? No, you just called me stupid. Stupid brain syndrome? It's Come a on. real syndrome. I'm gonna Google that and if you're wrong, Do it. 